Hello everyone, I just wanted to come and share with you a small haul of things that I purchased recently. Um, I have, believe it or not, I have not been doing a lot of shopping. I actually have been de-stashing a lot of my craft items on different Facebook groups. Um, I will also probably come on here to um, de-stash a few of my items as well. Probably will do a video of some items that I have um, for sale that I am selling. I'm actually trying to clean out my craft room and just really kind of just use the things that I'm that I know I'll be using. I don't want to just hoard things. So I think in maybe January, December, I started de-stashing a lot of my craft items. Um, mostly I am doing project life. So if I feel like I'm never just going to get around to using it, I am going to be de-stashing it. So I did do some hauls and this is like over a period of time. So I just wanted to share with you some things that I purchased for my planner i have really been loving my simple stories planner for those of you that have not took the plunge yet in purchasing a planner i really do urge for you all to get the planner it really really made a big difference in my life a huge difference so i wanted to come on here and just share with you some things that i purchased for my planner some things that i have been um up to so let me start in um tell you some things i purchased these pins right here from staples they were on sale they were not on sale in the store they were on sale in online but if you do print the online um information out and then take it to your local staples they will honor it these were on sale for 6.99 they are normally 12.99 they do have a larger pack of 20 However, my staples did not have the larger pack of 20. They only had the 10 pack. So I just went ahead and purchased the 12 pack of these for $6.99. So you can print it out and then take it to your local staples and they'll honor the $6.99 price. I know a lot of people are using these. I bought two packs of these. So this is the pack that's unopened. So I purchased those for my planner. Another thing that I purchased for my planner, um, I don't have a lot of planner stamps at all. The one thing that I did purchase is this exercise stamp right here. I thought that this was so stinking cute. And this is by Pink and Main. This one is really nice. It's small. It's It really is cute. I really like this one a lot. Um, I'm not sure if a lot of you know, but I have been dieting in yesterday, which was April the 11th, was my first day exercising in the gym. I joined the gym on it's on Friday. I joined Planet Fitness. They had like a thing down like ten dollars down, ten dollars a month. However, I did the twenty dollar plan so that way I can go anywhere that I want. So what I did was I sacrificed my Technique Tuesday stamp to go to Planet Fitness. Yes, you heard me right. I sacrificed my Technique Tuesday stamp set each month to join Planet Fitness. I said to me, I think that it was worth it. In the long run, it made sense for me to do that. So I gave that up to change um, my life. So I wanted to do that. So um, I started yesterday and I worked out for about an hour and 15 minutes. Um, I really want to do my legs, my arms, like cardio. I'm starting with cardio. So um, I'm going back actually today after I finish doing these videos and let my phone charge up. I will be back into the gym again today i plan on going at least four days out of seven days a week that's what my plan is so i bought these fitness stamps and to you know log all of my health stuff in there another thing that i got i got this um which one is it okay this is this one right here i bought this one right here also from sweet stamp shop this is an exercise one as well and I thought that this was really cute. I like that they had the scale on it, the weights, cardio, weight lifting, foods that you eat. So that was really cute. This one right here I think is great for women. Um, it has like ovulating. Uh, if you are, you know, if you're on your menstrual cycle, it says period, bleeding, heavy light, PMS. Um, it has on here, uh, I think it was like a little pill on one of these. No, it's not on this one. But it's, you could put on here, like, um, if you want to get a pedicure, you and your girlfriends are going now. Um, I guess, like, this is birth control, new pack. Um, if you had to get your hair done, I guess this right here means, you know, little period panties, as we would call them. 
So I thought that this was really, really cute for a woman. This right here is like a mammogram, your pap smear. I just really think that this one is a really good one for women. This one right here is um, like more so, I guess, like food one. On here, it has um, groceries, bills, breakfast, um, payday, snack, um, dessert, dinner, prep, like all food and stuff. So this one is a cute one. So I brought these right here for my planner. Another stamp set that I received was Citrus Twist. I still am subscribed to Switch Citrus Twist and Ali Edwards. Um, the ones that I don't like of Ali Edwards, I wind up selling on the Facebook groups because um, it cost a hundred dollars to cancel her subscription. So that's why I actually canceled um, Technique Tuesday instead of canceling hers because it was a hundred dollars. So I said each one, whatever ones I don't want, I just sell. So this one right here was a Citrus Twist stamp for April. Then I also bought these right, this stamp right here, Latte Anya, and I will be doing some of my pocket letters with her. I thought this was really cute, and it was like with the coffee cup theme. So I bought this right here. This one I bought off a of Facebook group. Um, I did not get it when it first came out, and then after me seeing several different YouTube videos and little things that you can make with it, once I saw it, I got this. So this is a cute stamp set. Um, another stamp set that I purchased since I am doing pocket letters right now, I purchased this one right here. This was the Pink Paisley Pen Pile. I wanted to get the whole line. However, I could not find the whole line, I guess because of the whole pocket letter pen pile craze. So I did get the stamp set and I got this for a great price. Last but not least, um, I did like the October afternoon Saturday mornings collection. So I did purchase a few things from that line. Um, I got the doodads from that line. Um, these are called Tibbets. So I purchased those. I also got the memory mix cards. Um, this right here are the borders and labels. And these are the word stickers. So that is my little haul. As you see, it's not big at all. I really have been doing such a great job and I'm proud of myself. I really only buy what I feel like I am going to use or that I can use um, on several different things since I'm trying to scale down a lot of my craft items. So most likely I will be back. Um, I would say probably about the, I'm gonna try to do one at the end of the week with a D stash video showing you some of the things that I have that I would like to D stash and if you would like to buy them they will be yours. So um that will be coming up. That will probably be my next video. That and more of my pocket letters that I'll be sending out. So I hope you all enjoy your Sunday. Thanks for watching my videos. Bye bye.